Hello my lovies, welcome back to my channel. Hello my lovies, welcome back to my channel. Today we are going to be down on Mama's Empanadas. If you're new to my channel, welcome to the fam bam lovey. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button and turn on that post notification. <laughs> Enough mumbo jumbo. Let's get down to the nitty gritty. If you've never had Mama's Empanadas, they're basically an empanada. It's a Colombian place. It's a chain of empanadas. And they have like a huge variety of them not every location is good though but the original one is the one from queens it's on northern and 84th i believe around there um so i got a what is this a cheesesteak empanada a pernil Mm, pepperoni, the spicy chicken, chicken parm, and then for a dessert one, I got maduros con queso and powdered sugar on top. It sounds crazy, but don't knock it till you try it. And then I have a um, caldo de carne or like a beef stew soup whatever you guys want to translate it to they only have they have like certain soups on certain days it's another chilly day here so i said why not you know what i'm saying so this has like meat yuca potato corn if you've never had colombian soup go to a colombian restaurant and get their soup I'm sorry. Colombians have by far some of the best soups. Call it what you want. Okay. If this is like a Dominican, the Colombian Sancocho. You know, the Dominican soup that they usually have? This is like the Colombian version. Between Dominicans and Colombians, I love their soups. They have such good soups. So, yeah. It's like 70 degrees here. I'll give you guys. Mm. Baby. Yeah. That's popping. What you do is you take some of the white rice. You put just the caldo, the liquid part. Mm-hmm. Potato. Oh, hot. Oh, my God. Yeah. Mm hmm. I could eat soup in whatever weather. Boiling, hot, freezing cold is even better. In the fall. But like now that like fall is approaching, and these past two days have been giving me those fall feels. I'm so excited. I can't wait. Oh, look, they even put plantains. Sorry for the noise. I'm telling you. Find the Colombian spot and get some soup. Bomb. You'll never go back. All right. Let's start off with my all-time favorite. The Bernie. Or should we start with this one? Let's start from here this way. We see the dessert for last. Yeah, yeah, okay. So, this is the cheesesteak. They're all fried. You could get them fried or baked. 
this place offers you. I should have gotten a knife. Wasn't very smart of me. I'm gonna break them in half so you guys could see <sighs> the inside. Oh, this is the cheesesteak one. So it has cheese, steak, onions, peppers. This one looks a little better. Let's do this one. <laughs> so it's like a Philly cheesesteak. And they have sauces, the green one, the red spicy one, and then this is mayo ketchup. But I'm not gonna lie, they were hella cheap today. They only gave me one of each, like bruh. I use like one sauce on one empanada. I like my shits saucy. But the green one is my favorite. Mm hmm I think certain sauces go with certain empanadas. Like the Philly cheesesteak. Whoa. I'm going to go with Mayu ketchup because to me it just goes. Mm-hmm. Yeah. That one's good. Now, we get to the star of the show. This is the pernil one. First of all, look at how fat it is. They are not skimpy with it, baby. Like, look at that. It's literally shredded pernil. On this one, I like to go with the pica, the red one. Like, woo. Mm hmm. The pernil one is by far. It's just perfect. It's not dry. It's not. They're not skimpy. Ooh. Put a lot of pica. Mm hmm. Followed up with some soup, baby. Mm -hmm. Thank me later. Thank me later. All right, now we got the pepperoni. This one used to be my favorite in high school because you can't go wrong with a pepperoni like what cheese bowl 10 out of 10 it's literally a pizza and an empanada mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. they're not cheap with the filling in this place. Some places are. Some places be hella cheap. When you open it, it's just shell, you know? Not here, baby. 
This one's a spicy chicken. Now, I usually don't get chicken empanadas because they could be dry. But my sister was the one that put me onto this one. And let me tell you. It's not dry. This one has chicken. They put peppers. It's spicy. Like, it's really spicy. But it's really good. So this one, of course, we gotta throw that green sauce because it's already spicy. You know, gotta balance it out. Mhm. Mm mhm. Mm they like cooked them. Oh. <clears throat> They cook the chicken and peppers, tomatoes. Mm. No. If you don't like spicy, you're not going to like this one because it's really spicy. Mmm. That one has jalapenos. I definitely should have mentioned that. <laughs> mm -hmm. I love you kind of soup. Mm -hmm. Oh. Oh, God. And then this is the chicken parm. This is another one of my favorites. This one has obviously breaded chicken. <laughs> um, it's literally a chicken parm in an empanada. Excuse me. This one I dump in the mayo ketchup. I don't care what you people say. Mm hmm The sausage just make it good. Mm hmm Shout out to one of my subscribers, Mousy. She reminded me about Mama's Bananas. And then I was like, oh shit, I've never done a Mama's Bananas video. So. Mm-hmm. 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 I got mocos coming out from that freaking spicy chicken. <laughs> so how am I love you doing? I hope everyone's enjoying their last. Two weeks of summer? Less? It's less. I know some people, some kids even went back to school already. Like, I think Florida started school already, right? Mm hmm.
Mm. We're going to save that one for last. That's the dessert one. And I know what you're thinking, like, maduros with queso. Don't knock until you try it, boo-boo. Mm-hmm. And I feel like their empanadas are still not a bad price. Like, there's some banana, pl banana places that sell theirs for, like, $5 each. This place is, like, $2 and change each. Like, $3. Because some people will be like, oh, if it's not a plain, like, meat or chicken one, it's like a specialty in banana. And then they charge, like, five bucks each for it. On five dollars for a little one banana, I'm sorry, but it'd be a bit much sometimes. So, but that's just my opinion. Depending, of course, on the quality. I'm waiting for this place to make like a oxtail and plan. Because if you know me, you know I love oxtails. Oh man, I got mocha filler. And yes, I've been obsessed with this color. All right, let's go in for the dessert one. Maduros con queso. You could get it with powdered sugar or no powdered sugar on top. Still got cheese though. I get it with powdered sugar. They smashed some sweet plantain. Mixed with cheese. They used the sweet plantain that wasn't that sweet. So it's kind of lacking today, but. Mm hmm. The powdered sugar on top makes up for it. Mm -hmm. <laughs> what? My mom is looking at me like, You want to try the Maduro con queso? My mom's not crazy about mamas and banana. She's biased. She thinks Argentinian bananas are the best. 
But that's because <clears throat> Argentinians bake theirs. So she doesn't really like the fried stuff, you know? All right, my lovies. Don't forget to give this video too big thumbs up. Don't forget to like, comment, share, subscribe. Tell a friend, tell a friend, tell a friend to join the fam bam. And until next time, remember, let's spread positive vibes, good laughs, and yummy eats. Peace.